We'll guide you through how to fix an iPhone won't connect to Wi-Fi. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. This problem can be really annoying as you're then unable to go and use the internet on your iPhone. And to do pretty much everything on your iPhone, you need to have a connection to the internet, to browse it, to go and get apps and loads of other things. So we're gonna guide you through some different fixes you can try. So make sure this full video to the different things you can do. So to get started, go and open up the settings app on your iPhone like so. Go down and find the option for Wi-Fi and you want to go and tap there. So if you're finding it says you're connected, but you're finding you aren't, then what you can try doing is you press the I to the right and you can press forget this network. If you're finding that the iPhone isn't connecting at all, then we'll still go and come and fix for that. But then what you want to do is if you can try rejoining, tap there. You can then go and enter in the Wi-Fi password. We'll then press join and we'll go and see if it works. If it does, then great. Sometimes just going and doing that will get it working. If it still doesn't, the next thing you want to try doing is coming down to mobile service. Here you need to go and scroll all the way down and you need to go and find the option for Wi-Fi assist as otherwise it will go and use mobile data if the Wi-Fi connectivity is poor. Try turning that off, see if that solves the problem. If you're still finding it won't connect, the next thing you want to try doing is checking VPNs. Often if your phone is trying to connect or is connected to a VPN, it can go and stop the Wi-Fi from connecting. So what you can do is in your settings is come down to general, then you can go and scroll down and you can go and find the option for VPN and device management and tap there. So if you've got a VPN, you can go and remove it here. You may be using a VPN with an app. So if that's the case, you can go and go to the app and go and disconnect it. And then that's what you can do is after you've gone and disconnected it, you can return to Wi-Fi and go and see if you can now go and connect. If you're still finding you can't, the next thing you want to do is come into general. And in here, you need to go and find the option for dates and time. And you want to go and make sure this is being set automatically. Sometimes if the iPhone's uh, time and date is incorrect, Wi-Fi networks won't allow you to go and join. So try making sure that it's set to automatic and that the time and date is right on your device. For the next fix, drag down in the top right of your iPhone like so to open the control center. Then what you want to do is go and turn on airplane mode like so. Make sure Wi-Fi is turned off as well. Then you want to go and open up your settings. You want to go and scroll down and find the option for privacy and security and tap there. Then you can go and press location services. You need to go and scroll down and go and find system services at the bottom. And what you then want to do is go and find the option for networking and wireless. Switch that off and you can then go and press turn off like so. Then what we're going to do is a forced restart. So press the volume increase, decrease, and tap and hold the side power button. Now keep this held down. You'll go and see this screen here. Shortly, it's going to go black, but you still keep holding that side power button down. As you can see, it's now black. Keep it held down. Shortly, you're going to go and see the Apple icon. And that means the phone's starting again. And at that point, you can release. Go and open up your settings and you need to go and scroll down and find privacy and security again. Then you want to come into location services and you need to go and find system services and you want to go and switch on networking and wireless like so. With that on, you then want to go and drag down to open the control center, turn off airplane mode, make sure Wi-Fi comes back on. And then what you can try doing is coming back to your Wi-Fi and hopefully now the device will go and connect to the Wi-Fi. If you're finding that it still isn't working, the next fix you can try doing is come back to your settings as we are here. And you want to go down, find the option for general, tap there. Scroll down and find the option for transfer or reset iPhone. And you can go and tap there. And then you want to go and press reset. And what you can do is go and reset the network settings. Often doing this is going to go and solve the problem. It's important to note this will go and remove all of the uh, Wi-Fi networks you've connected to before. And you have to go and reconnect with the password. But if you can't currently connect, then it's worth doing. So you can go and enter in your passcode and wait for it to complete. And then after it's gone and completed, you come back to your main settings. And what you can do is then go and connect to the Wi-Fi. And hopefully now it will go and work. If you're still finding it isn't, then do just make sure your Wi-Fi router is definitely properly working. It probably is as you're watching this video, but what's worth doing is going and restarting it. Could be a problem with the router. So turn it off and back on. And hopefully your iPhone will then go and connect and the problem solved. If you found this useful and want to see more guys like this, then please consider subscribing and liking the video.